Again? It's Sergeant Meyer, M-E-Y-E-R. Sweet. Um, okay. Yes, I did want to talk to the supervisor for Deputy Schaefer. Okay, uh, what can I do for you? Uh, did you hear what I said occurred? Uh, or did you, what, what could you tell me about the traffic stop that occurred yesterday? Uh, uh, two days ago? Yeah, two days ago. Wait, it was... Yeah, I... <laughs> I basically got uh, got something from Lieutenant Larsh and Lieutenant Lehman that said that you wanted to talk to Trent, uh, Deputy Schaefer's supervisor, and that was pretty much what it was limited to. So, okay, so you have no idea why the traffic stop occurred, or uh, no. if you you said no. No, I don't. I don't know. I I've been gone. I just got back to work today, so that's why I'm calling you. Okay. Uh, well, I think the traffic stop was illegal. Okay. Um, I, I think he violated my civil rights because he felt like it. Okay. Uh, he, uh, um, I, I don't know, or he doesn't think I my civil rights are legitimate. I don't know. Okay. I feel like he, I'm sorry, I'm trying to tell you something, but it's really difficult. I, I think, I think he didn't care for a moment. That uh, that people have you can't pull someone over because you feel like it. Okay. I think. What did he tell you that he pulled you over for? He he said he the first thing he said when he approached my car was why are you yelling out the window? Okay. Uh, and then I asked him several times, uh, uh, why did you pull me over? And he mm -hmm. he didn't tell me. He okay. he didn't have an answer. Okay. Uh, he he still didn't tell me even after the traffic stop was over and they took me out of handcuffs and he drove away. Okay. I asked again why he stopped me and he told me that yelling out the window is uh, was basically why he pulled me over. Okay. Um, uh, and I told him that's a First Amendment free speech. And yeah. uh, he said, "Well, you better have good luck at work or something like that." Uh, because he called my employer and told them that I yelled out the window, and uh, and that was the worst thing that he did. I think he he acted unprofessionally, and I think okay. it's a I think he committed a like um, I think he abused power. I don't know. Okay. I don't really know too much, uh, but I do know it should be illegal to stop someone uh, without them violating some traffic law, okay. and with and without probable cause. Sure. Yep. Do you agree? Would, yeah, yeah. Um, what did, uh, so you weren't issued a citation or anything like that? No. Sir? I, sa I said no. Oh, okay. I, d I didn't hear you. Um, okay. And, all right. I will, what I'm going to do is I'm going to, I, I have requested the video from the stop. So, were you were you working when this occurred, sir? Yes. Okay. Who do you work for? And I'm not going to contact him. I'm just curious. Uh, a company called CS Logistics. Okay. Were you driving their vehicle or what? Yes. Okay. Okay. And it, just so I have my information correct, you were. Let me just pull it up here. Uh. This was at Progress Drive and Femrite Drive? Femrite Road, something like that. Yep, okay, yep. And, all right, okay. All right, what I'm gonna do is I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna pull the video and, um, and, if, uh, and uh, I will get back to you and, um, and let you know what the disposition on this is, all right? And if I have further questions, can I contact you at this number? Yes. Uh, I'll, I also have an email. If I don't answer, uh, feel free to email me. Sure. What's that number? What's your email address? Okay. So, so what I'm going to do is um, I, I'm done in about uh, 30 minutes for, okay. there, for today, but I will, uh, I will end the video is not ready anyway. Once I get that, I will review that. I will talk to Deputy Schaefer, and um, I will get back to you if I have any further questions, or otherwise you'll be getting a disposition, okay? Okay, and I, just be, before you leave, I kind of wanted to know, like, some facts of law or whatever. I don't know how things go. 
you you can't pull someone over for yelling out the window, correct? Well, if that's the only thing, um, it, it, dep- it would depend on what was being yelled. I mean, is it is it threatening? Is it threats to harm somebody? That may be that may be enough to at least have contact with somebody to say, hey, what was the what was the threat? I don't know the situation, so I really I really don't want to lead you in the wrong direction if. If you know, until I know better uh, what was said or anything like that, on on Deputy Schaefer's, you know, part. As far as like legal questions, um, I, I I don't give legal que- or uh, I don't give legal advice. So I would say if you if you would like to know, just contact uh, contact an attorney, and they would definitely be able to help you with that. Okay. It, oh, I thought like on a crew. That's just not in. That's not uh, in the in the business that we're in. Is giving legal advice. All right. No, 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 no. I wasn't asking for like legal advice. I was sure. asking like, as a police officer, would you yes. would you pull someone over for yelling out the window? Is that it, a crime? And it would. And it would. Well, it would depend on what was. Like I said, it would just depend on what was being yelled. If it was. If it was nothing in a a threatening manner or anything like that. Um, If it was nothing that, you know, if somebody yells help out the window, I may stop them because I need to know what's going on. If somebody, do you know what I'm saying? Um, So it it would depend on what was being said, but uh, as as a typical answer to that, no. No, I wouldn't. Okay. And then um, uh, my other question was, there's, there's the, inside the squad cars, there's recording, right? Yep. So if, so if he his window was down, he probably heard it was probably recorded whatever was said. Sure. Yeah. All right. Well, I'm I'm gonna tell you. Uh, I said the words "go fuck yourself" out the okay. window. That's what I said. Um, I I firmly believe your officer was uh, participating in like group harassment. Okay. And and I'm I'm one thousand percent certain he did that. And I normally don't, I don't say those words to anyone for, unless, sure. unless I see the same behavior that I've uh-huh. seen in different places. Sure. So, so that's why I said those words to him. I don't hate police officers. I don't disrespect okay. police officers. I, I believe police officers are mostly good. And sure. every once in a while you see or hear about a bad police officer. And I, I would, I would agree a hundred percent with that statement. And, uh, and, and, and. I, I usually, I, I, after so many years of, of the repeated behavior, I had to start speaking up for myself. And sure. that's what, those are the words I came up with. Um, and, I, and, and, and long story short, it, they do match the behavior. The, the, what the, the, these gestures that some officers give me, the, what they mean, the, the response is, is, is fair. So okay. I'll, t- I could tell you about it later, but I, I doubt you have enough time. Um, uh, and I, I, uh, crap, I'm trying to think. Um, I, uh, I, I do feel like he baited me. I, I, I honestly feel that way. I think okay. he knew I was going to say those words before I said them. I, I'm almost 1,000% positive. And then I also believe he followed me to see if I'd make a traffic violation. I am almost positive that that's the sequence, that's the series of, that's the way he was thinking. And... I didn't make a traffic violation, and he pulled me over anyways. Okay. Um, I think he wanted to retaliate uh, for okay. all the times I've said those words uh, uh, in response to the gestures or the, 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 the aggressive squad car movements that I see some police officers do around me. Sure. And I think he decided to do something illegal, and he decided to make, uh, make, a, make a statement either stop me from saying those words to scare me to intimidate me or because he didn't care or he got angry and emotional and acted unprofessionally either way it was scary it was illegal and i and i also believe he deleted camera footage from my camera while he was in his squad car or uh, as he arrested me possible. what'd he you say can't, he, he can't delete camera oh, from his squad car footage no, from 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 my from my personal camera. Oh, okay. Uh, well, I would be able to see that from the uh, 
from inside the squad car because there's cameras, so I'll look for that. Okay, thank you. Um, and that, that, that's about it. I, I don't have punishments in mind. I don't, I don't think about consequences that much. I'm sure. just trying my best to tell. And I, I really want this stuff to stop happening. I, I really sure. want, want police officers have you, to... Have you run into Deputy Schaefer before in the past? Or no. Uh, okay. Okay. All right. Okay. I think I, I think I have what I need, Mr. Lattimore. Okay. I will definitely look into this and I will get back to you, okay, sir? All right, cool. All right, you have a good weekend. All right, you too. Thanks, bye-bye. Thank you.